hi guys um today i have a um quick little haul for you all that i did this morning at michael's i went into michael's today to try to get um one of the paper pads they have because i want to make a traveler's notebook and um a minute album for halloween themes of course um but my local michael's doesn't have it right so now i gotta wait but in the meantime i did pick up some other things and i just wanted to share them with you all real quick so first um they have michael's has some stickers um that they didn't have last year so i was like oh pretty stickers let me get them and right now they're buy one get one half off so first i got these really cool white and black pumpkins and I think they had these last year, but I didn't buy them, so I picked them up this year. Um, I am planning on doing um, a Day of the Dead, Dias de las Muertas, um, themed mini album, if I can find the right paper. Just trying to make sure I'm in frame. Um, so they had these, so I got these. They're really cute, the little skulls. And then um, I picked up these glittery witch brooms and hats which they did have last year and i ran out because i used them um on a crafting project which i still have there were some really cute cupcake toppings that i'll probably share with you guys if i can dig those up so i got those then um they have these which they didn't have last year and i've never seen them before and i think they're awesome and they would be good for um inserts and um the one tn that i'm going to be working on and they're halloween tower cards aren't these things awesome they also could work in mini albums as well um because they look like they would be good um to put a picture in the back like a three and a half by five something like that so let's just see if i can break these puppies open for you guys so we can see what they look like oh and they have plastic on them great right plastic okay so oh they're really nice they're like glossy and they're black and white oh they're really cute so you have um the magician the chariot centaur the hermit yeti strength manicor hanged man imp devil tower gargoyle yeah, moon werewolf sun phoenix judgment cerebrus and if you do, guys don't know because i'm into mythological and super things supernatural cerebrus is the hound of hell he's the hell hound that block that is at the entrance of hell or once you get off the river sticks world or and it is basically a snake eating itself in the sign of infinity empress kali Oh, this is something I've never seen before. A voodoo warlock. Huh, that's different. Eight of Cups skeleton. Four of Cups ghoul. King of Cups orc. Eight of Pentacles zombie. And Nine of Pentacles Frankenstein. These are really, really cool. So I will definitely maybe grab another box to hoard um, when I go back. But I will definitely be using those. So I picked up those. And then I picked up um this if you can see it make sure it's frame um the sticker book um it's entitled wicked but it goes really really well with the um i think it's called moonlight haunting which is a paper pad that i wanted to get that they didn't have so i'll just show you it says um there's these stickers here there are some skeleton stickers these are um more like animal skeletons and insects and birds then we look like we have um some tarot stuff here this is definitely tarot stuff with the sun and the moon um some chandeliers and spiders and things on these and these stickers i love them because they have gold foiling on them then there's some alphabets. Um, this one is like romantic 
goth type deal like and it says you are spellbinding these remind me of like Edgar Allan Poe ish a little bit these stickers then we have some sticker washi here I love this gold foiling on these stickers um, another tarot one and this one says um, palm readings here then there's some sticker tags and page flags and stuff this is the same thing we have some more sticker washi down here and then there looks like some photo corners there and that's it so if you're interested the title of this sticker book is wicked with the skull on the front then um since I love Halloween, Halloween is one of my biggest holidays I like to celebrate and decorate my house and all that stuff. So they had um, some of their decor pieces 30% off, so I couldn't help myself. So I picked up um, this little, let me see if I can zoom out just a little bit so you guys can see the whole thing. Um, not really, so we're going to have to work with what we got. Um, so it is a book, a little magic book. Inside is Blay, but it looks like pages and stuff, like one of those really cute books that I would either stack on my table or um, next to my TV in my living room. I picked up two of those. So this is the second one. And this one has a spider on the front and it says poison. And the spine says poison, so you guys can read that, like that. The back looks like that. And of course the pages. Um, then I picked up a couple of more decor pieces because I just can't help myself. So I picked up this um, and it's a bottle. It's glass. It's really cute. Um, it has a little bat on top. Um, some velvet, some gorgeous purple velvet ribbon. And then it says crushed wings fine mix of bat wings, eyeballs, and saliva. Then, I like to pick up things in pairs. So I picked up this one, and it has the same ribbon. It has a raven on the top, so you can see that. And it says, ravens brew for a long-lasting deep sleep. And then, I picked up another set of decorative jars. I'm just getting out of this wrap because they're glass. And ah, oh, this is so cute. See the top? The top is gorgeous, right? Looks so adorable. It's ceramic. It's black, of course. Um, it says potions, 1587. Unfiltered potions with the skull on top. Love that. And then, since I mentioned I like getting things in sets, purple's my favorite color. So I got this one. Um, this is also it's like frosted glass this one um, and it says spider venom now these don't open they are glued down but they're for decorative purposes um, and I'm just gonna use them to decorate my living room since I love Halloween so that's what I got and then I picked up two paper pads like I mentioned guys I went to get the moonlight hauntings paper pack Oh my gosh, let me move some of this stuff out the way because you guys can't see the awesomeness that are these paper pads. Um, so I will have to go back or try another Michaels um, this weekend or maybe try my Michaels on Monday so I can go back and try to get the Hauntings paper pad because I want to make, like I said, TNs for my shop and a really cool mini album that I have buzzing around in my mind. And I want to use the stickers that I bought um, to go in that. So, but, so I was rummaging around and they're having a 70% off sale on their paper again. I love Michaels, but they're 75% off their hot buy papers. So these papers literally are normally $20 and they're now 5 dollars And the sale is on until Saturday because you know every Sunday there is a new sale. So I picked up this one. It is called Constell Constellations, and it's gorgeous. It has uh, it's twelve different designs. We know, you know, they don't do double sided, which is kind of okay. But it has some foiling and stuff like that, so I love it. I love the color scheme because I did say before my my favorite color is purple. 
So let's crack this puppy open real quick. And let me give you a quick flip through of what this thing looks like. Okay, we'll do it this way so you guys can see it. So first page, let me see if I can do this. I think that's better. And there, there are three by four cut aparts, which are absolutely gorgeous. And they have this hollow um, treatment on them. Ah, so pretty, so pretty, so pretty. So there's two sheets of those. And then there's this sheet of this, let me turn it this way a little bit, of like the sky and it's like white flecks and stuff like that. And then there is this design here, which is really cool. Then there is this hollow, looks like um, connecting sunburst or something. I'm not quite sure, but it's awesome. Then you have like the sun and the moon. Then these circles upon circles upon more circles, like um, I guess magenta color. Yeah. Then there's this black with circle dots all over it. Then we have um, the constellations in itself, and it's this like blue, bluish color, which is kind of cool. Then we have this circle design here. We have this connected dot pattern. We have another night sky and another like purplish violet blue color. It's really pretty. Then we have like this scattered dot pattern and it's hollow as well. See, look at that, it's so awesome. Um, then we have this, no, it's like ombre and it goes from purple to green, it's really pretty. Then we have this here. Then we have the sun and the moon in a black background, but everything else is hollow. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Then we have um, that same circular dot pattern in a blue color. Then we have all of um, the signs here. Um, my birthday is coming up. I am a Virgo. So I'm thinking I'm going to use this paper to make two TNs. One Virgo thing and then one Libra thing to put on my shop. Then we have this connected dot pattern in that magenta color. Then we have another night sky. It reminds me of Aurora Borealis over um, Alaska. It's so gorgeous, the colors in this. Um, then we have another hollow design here. Then we have um, like intergalactical night sky here. Then we have sun and moon. We have no, no suns. These are all the faces of the moon. From crescent moon to full moon and it's hollow. It's really nice. Um, then we have constellations again. Then we have the different constellations of the signs, which is gorgeous. That's it. Then um, I bought this one, and it is Autumn Dream. And it says treatments, and I flipped through it real quick before I purchased it, and it's gold foiling treatments. It's really nice. So we're going to go through this one really quick. So you have that, this wood grain pattern, these fall color, autumn. Show us how beautiful it is to let things go. This one has lots of words on it. This one is a leaf, and it says breathe in the autumn air. Some more leaves. Cutter pots in different sizes. It's really nice. Leaves in a different color. Border strips. This it's um it's like graphic paper in the background, but like water stain. It's really cool. It's really cute. I kind of like it. Um, some realistic leaves. Some six by six cut parts. Some leaves with gold foiling. Oh, we get three pages of that. That's different. Um, right here, it looks like a field of autumn flowers. Um, this complete and total page of gold foiling leaves. It's really nice. This page here. Some more words in a different color. This kind of reminds me of like field of wheat sort of kind of we have some letters 
um, some leaves in a pattern. This is gorgeous. If I did a fall thin tan, and I'm seriously thinking about doing at least one, probably B6 size, this is like a road of like gorgeous red and oranges when the, um, the trees start to change color. That's what that looks like, and it's so gorgeous. And then we have a close-up of leaves changing. Some more here. And then that's it. So once again, the paper pads are Autumn Dream and Constellations. And I will be definitely sharing um, you guys what I make with these like I always do. So until then, guys, bye-bye.